I got some numbers. Let's do some numbers. All right, here are the numbers inside the news. All right. Here you go. Uh, listen to this. According to the website, 538. Based on Google web searches, who was the most popular team in Los Angeles? <laughs> well, there are so many of them. The Raiders are the number one searched t- t- NFL team in Los Angeles, according to Google. 49ers are second. The Chargers are third. The Rams, 30th. 30th? Yes. Oh, my. Yeah, how about that? Mm. Who knew? Um, <laughs> let's see here. Oh, uh, in Whitefish, Montana, a fee to apply for a parade is $125. How do I know that? Mm. I know that because the Nazi party wanted to put on a parade and they sent in their application and it was incomplete they only sent in sixty dollars short of the required fee so the white supremacists and neo-nazis now hope to hold their march sometime in february can't wait for that one (laughs) uh if and when the affordable care act is repealed for those of you making a million dollars you're in luck according to cnbc you, if you earn more than a million dollars, will get a tax cut of up to $49,000. Oh, really? Yes. And finally, whenever President-elect Donald Trump tweets about Mexico, the peso jumps around on the international <laughs> currency markets. Mexico is spending a considerable fortune and reserves defending their currency. But peso traders have come up with a cheaper solution. And what is that, McGraw? They have floated the idea of just buying Twitter for $12 billion and shutting it down. That, according to an article in uh, Bloomberg. A bit extreme. Well, if you're spending more than $12 billion to 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 steady your currency. Let's just buy Twitter. Let's just buy Twitter. 756, those are the numbers inside the news on the Big 550 KTRS.